back to winemastery.co.uk. Here we are in the green hills of the Pennines in a town called Conferth at the Nook Brewery. And it's been here since the, the 18th century, back in 1734. So uh, uh, originally uh, brewing uh, beer that long. So very strong heritage, mm -hmm. uh, fantastic group. We've already, we've already tried two, and we're now on to uh, the third, which is? The Tide of Porter now. We're on to now, yeah. So and it's called? Tide of Porter. Tide Mouth. Tiger Moth. Tiger Moth, excuse me. After right, the airplane. After the airplane. After the airplane. Yeah, Is there yeah. any reason? What, what made you choose that name? Uh, it's to do with the Royal, uh, with, with the, the actual airplane itself. Okay. You know, a donation goes to the Royal Medical Fund. Oh, is it? Yeah. Really, yeah? So, yeah, oh, so well done. So, five million bottle goes towards that. Yeah, oh, fantastic. So, Excellent. Great. Your charity goes towards that, so. Yeah. But he's a local man who's got a Tiger Moth who lives you know, a couple of miles on the road and he does that sort of flights. Right. So the donation goes to the charity again, right? So we yeah, fly all of us and all. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shows, yeah, and all, all that. Yeah. So we do a collaboration with him, and uh, and yeah, so it's a charity thing. Fantastic. Well, like, yeah. So you can drink it and actually feel good about drinking it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, well. <laughs> it's spot on. It's spot on. Isn't it? Let's have a look at it. Let's have a look at it. Well, actually, the the, the kind of I'm just thinking in terms of um, more almondy brown. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's definitely, yeah, has that kind of. It's still quite nice and bright, you can see yeah. that coming through. It's sort of toffee. Mm. Yeah. And, 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 yeah. And. That's not as strong a nose as the previous two. No, it? that's quite. And I was expecting, I mean, it's just an assumption, isn't it? Because it's getting darker. I assume they're going to get stronger and more powerful. But yeah. If that's not. I mean, actually, I'm. It's a bit coffeeish, but then out of nowhere I've got like an oak, and I don't know did where. Did you? I did, yeah, I know, I know. I know. He loves his own. I don't know. I assume he does not see the oak whatsoever. Wait, I'm waiting for one where he finds some leather in there. It's a matter of time, just a matter of time. It looks good, it smells good. That I've drunk, um, they always end up feeling a little bit sort of, you know, you wouldn't want to have too much of them, but that is. Yeah. And, and again, that's quite quite surprising on, on the flavour as well, because I expected that to uh, be bigger than it is, if you know yeah. what I mean. It's going to last, the length of the taste. It's still there. Like, yeah. yeah. It's that, that kind of um, a coffee and toffee kind of flavour comes through on this one. It's, it's, it's richer, it's definitely richer. But it kind of, for me, it kind of cleans up faster than the other two, or, or the num number two, definitely. Okay, kind of not, not quite as much, I don't think. No, so it's surprising. Yeah, and well, is, 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 is this as strong as the previous two? No, it's, it's slightly, we're going slightly down a little bit. It's uh, 1.2. 1.2, yeah. Well, now giving any secrets away, uh, what sort of hops and uh, malt are in Well, well? we've used a uh, strong hop to get through the, the malts on this one, so we use a brown and cross. Which is to cut through the malts to give, you know, because the malts take some, take some dominating, like, yeah, it yeah, takes yeah, some getting over the top. Especially the dark malts, yeah. Are they, are they from the UK or are they from America as well? Or? The Van yeah, yeah, I yeah, think from, uh, from the UK, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Excellent. I, I don't, is there any hops that are grown in Yorkshire, do you know? Is it all from the No, 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 it's just uh, Kent and Haven in uh, places like that. So, right. Yeah. But it's strange because you've there are a couple of vineyards. Well, in fact, there's a vineyard in Hofer, isn't there? Yes, yeah, so, yeah, yeah. So, um, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's, uh, How do you come up with the idea of of, of making a certain beer? Well, do, do, do you have a start process or you know, do you know what they're going to kind of taste like if you use that hop and, and these? Yes, yeah, yeah. yeah. You get yeah. taste profile. So, so, yeah, it's a lot, a lot of testing and. Uh, Try and build, yeah, but until you get what you want, like, you know. I presume you don't make a whole big sort no, of. No, 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 you just do a small batching and then yeah. uh, and take from there, like, yeah. So sounds like the awful job. I guess it's kind of my kind of job, I like the idea. <laughs> how, many, how many did you say, the last thing you mentioned, how many beers you actually produce? We do six in this car range, yeah. but we can do up to that. So you had to go through that horrible process 18 times. Oh. Yeah, yeah, it was a bit of taste. That's tough. Yeah. That's tough. That's tough. <laughs> that's tough. And do, do you sometimes make one and, and you think, no, that's not going to work, or it's 
Yeah. It's happened, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we just got it. It's a three down drain, yeah. yeah. It's gone, did you? Yeah. 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 Touch wood, yeah. it's not happened very often in that. No. Well, I guess experience, you, you just get to know what's, what's yeah, going to yeah, work yeah. and what's yeah, not. Think, yeah. yeah. It's just about tweaking it. Yeah, tweak what you've got and then, yeah. 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 Hopefully, yeah. it's going to work out. Mmm. And that's a great tiger, tiger moth. Mm. Mm. That should go flying off the shelf. <laughs> <laughs> I did one on you. I think, I think, I think uh, you should try a little flutter on, on this, and I'm sure you're actually sort of it'll be a roaring success. No. <laughs> I am terribly sorry. I'm terribly sorry. Mm. Oh, but it's delightful. Mm. I see so, it is um, in his glasses. You, you, you do beer festivals. We do beer festivals. We do two a year. Yeah, one in the uh, one in March, one in uh, August. Yeah, and so yeah, we keep uh, swapping his beers out here and everywhere. Yeah, so. And one, it might well be worth mentioning if you don't actually live sort of uh, in and around Yorkshire that uh, the the, uh, the brewery also has uh, rooms, so you can actually sample the beers and not have to drive or even go home that night. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. looking for your watch here and, and sleep here. Yeah, but, but what more could you? What more could you want? Look for me. Okay, so. What's next in? What's next on me? Uh, we're going to move down the line this time to. Uh, we we've got a brown ale, we've got a nookie brown ale, yeah. brown ale? Yeah, so it's a bit more. Wow, it's a long it. time since I had a brown My dad used to love brown ale. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> I remember nicking some when he wasn't looking, but. but <laughs> 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 it, was, it was always also my favourite for shandy. I haven't had a brown ale shandy for absolutely long, but. but uh, it was very, a uh, brown was really big <coughs> in London, I, and uh, certainly with, I know my dad's uh, youth, it was really, really yeah, big. Yeah. And I was a famous Newcastle brown ale as well, so I guess it's, it's not just brown Yeah, because of the water, it's all well because it's all well water. Yeah. So that seems better for making brown ale. Is yeah. it? Yeah. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah. Well, because it's, it's to sort of the chalk. Because by the time all the water percolates down from the sky, it takes up to some like, Forty years in some places to get through the rocks. Yeah. And as it's going through the rocks, it picks the different little minerals up and uh, you've got to say, say, take a certain water when you get down there. Oh, okay. You know, hard water. And not a lot of people know that, no. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I remember about London Minerals who was being told that uh, it's actually recycled seven times. Mm. Well, yeah, <laughs> probably, yeah, yeah, probably yeah, not yeah, yeah, by yeah, the yeah, yeah, yeah. The stuff that comes out of the <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, we'll get on to that then. Yes, indeed. We'll see you there. Mm. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.